Secret Cinema, Casino Royale. The long story short, you need to go to this. So welcome back to Being James Bond, and this is going to be a very short, very weird little review of Secret Cinema Casino Royale. Why short? Why weird? Well, the bottom line is this is an event that is loaded with surprises, and I don't want to ruin the experience in any way, shape, or form. So I'm going to give you just sort of a very peripheral overview of what it actually is because honestly before i actually did it i had no idea what this was i mean leading up to the actual event what le leading up to actually walking in i was pretty clueless what i was in for and honestly i was really glad that i was because it really made the whole experience probably even better uh but I will give you just sort of an overview of my feelings about it. By the way, you can check out this clip. James Bond Radio was there. Not only was I interviewed, but my girlfriend Mary was interviewed. I love this. Now I'm joined by Mary. Now, what was your alias tonight, Mary? I was Very nice. And what was your occupation? I'm a music mogul. Look how good she looks there. Look at look at her outfit. And look at my outfit. Holy cow. You should have seen the looks the two of us were getting on the tube on the way to this event. This was really funny. We were getting some serious, weird looks. So, I mean, you could probably do this several times and, and never have the same experience twice. I mean, I would genuinely do this again. So, anyway. So, like I said, I didn't know anything about this event going in. Um, so, it, it kind of made it more fun. So, again, I don't want to ruin anything, but I will just simply say this is something that if you, if you can get there, if you're in the area for sure, if you're in the UK, or if you could just get over to London at some point, you have to see this event. Uh, this is something that no James Bond fan and no Casino Royale fan should miss. Uh, and again, I don't have to tell you, if you're watching this, you know that I'm a huge fan of Casino Royale. So this was, wow, was this fun for me. I so enjoyed myself. I don't want to spoil too much of it. I will simply say that it is, not only is it a showing of the film, uh, but I almost feel like that's incredibly dismissive to, to just call it that because it's an interactive event. When you're watching the film, there are things that are happening. There are actors, there are people involved that will will do things that in association with the action on the screen that really sort of brings it to life. And the things leading up to the actual film is probably even better because there is such an immersive experience that you go through that sort of leads you through elements, and again, I don't want to say too much, but elements of Casino Royale. Meaning if you are a fan of the film, you will see what they've done and you'll love it. And if I had to sort of pinpoint what exactly is so incredible about this experience was the attention to detail. They really understand this film. They really studied this film. I mean, again, I have seen this film, I don't know how many times, they know the film as well as I do, if not more so. There were details of it that they got so right that honestly blew my mind. And there, there's an element of, again, any person going into this, this event will have fun. Like if, let's say you and your significant other, you're the Bond fan, she's not. Um, she will have a ball, and I mean a ball at this event. She will enjoy it so much. If you are the Casino Royale enthusiast and you know the film really well, you will enjoy it that much more. There were moments where I felt like because uh, Mary and I knew the film as well as we did, the, the, the interaction that was coming back to us was that much more exciting. And there was, there was that much more interaction for us because we knew the elements of the film. So again, if, so if you know the film well, you're gonna love this. Um, again, I'll probably just sort of leave it at that because again, this thing was just so much fun, so exciting, and and I mean, they just did such an amazing job. There was never a moment where, and again, I'm the guy. I've seen this film so many times. I mean, I could pretty much recite it to you, and I can. I've done essays, you know, podcasts, but but long podcasts detailing why I think this film is as good as it is and, and what makes it so great. So, I mean, you would think that that 
I of all people would be like, oh, well, they could have done this a little bit better. Oh, they kind of forgot that this person over here or whatever, or this part of the movie was a little... I'm telling you, there was not a moment where I thought, oh, they missed something or they could have done a little bit. They Everything they did was spot on accurate that you felt like you were a part of this film. Um, and I'll leave it at that. I, I, I really just can't gush more about this event. They did a spectacular job with it. And honestly, anybody who is who is on the fence about going, you have to go. I mean, go. You will not regret this, believe me. That's it. That is Secret Cinema. That is Secret Cinema Casino Royale, one of the, the most fun I've had. Uh, and again, original. This is something I've never done anything like this before. Um, I, I mean, people were asking me when I was leaving, like, what this was. They're like, and I was trying to sort of explain what little I knew. And they were like, is it like a murder mystery kind of a thing? And I go, maybe, kind of, I don't know. <laughs> again, I, I, I guess that was the only thing I could really compare it to. Um, so again, I, just go and discover it for yourself. You have to do this. Um, and by the way, check out James Bond Radio. They did interviews with a few of us coming out of the event. Uh, I'll put a link down in the description. Um, Calvin Dyson, I'm sure he's going to do one too because he was there and I know that he enjoyed himself immensely. But for now, again, Secret Cinema Casino Royale, go see it.